so, <laughs> so I love this movie and I think it's great that there's, you know, this is not just a coming out movie. Like it's about someone with options. And I'm sort of wondering why you loved this movie. Kind of the same reason that you loved it. I loved that it was completely normalized in this family and that this character, Peter, was just the single one. And we're just helping him try to find love for the holidays. That's what I loved about it, that it's just completely normal in this family. One of the family members is gay and it's not a big deal. <laughs> you grew up with um, with relatively famous parents and, or at least comedy parents. Um, did your family meddle in your life? No, <laughs> like, I was one of those 80s free range children. <laughs> If you came back before dinner, everything was cool. I mean, growing up, I dated a lot of interesting characters um, and my family just kind of went with it. I went with one guy like pre-Steve Jobs who wore nothing but the same like black jeans and black shirt every day. He was like a computer um, guy and he came to my brother's wedding and people thought he was the minister. I mean, it is amazing to think about what we got away with. Like my parents just had a bell outside that they rang and like we would come back. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> yeah, I, I did not own a bike helmet until I was like 30 years old. No. Uh, <laughs> um, in this movie, there is sort of a thing about fake trees versus real trees. And uh, I was wondering where you landed on that. I land full fake tree. I'm all fake tree. I live in a condo, so that's part of it. Maybe if I lived in a house and I just had to take it through my front door. It is, by the way, already up. I don't blame you. Who like it? But, um, yeah, I'm fake tree. I mean, you also are like promoting this movie. So like you have to have the Christmas spirit like on tap. Like it helps to, to like once you can turn it on, you I'm know. I'm also leaving town for work and coming back like two days before Christmas. <laughs> I want to always be ready to go when I get back, so. Yeah, I was always a real tree person. And then we bought, like, we like invested in like a nice fake tree instead of like a $45 one. And it was like, and we're like, oh, this is great. Yeah. Um, yeah. Last question. Um, in the movie, uh, they sort of talk about the mom's holiday drag name, Christmas Carol. Uh, do, you, do you have a holiday drag name? Or No, but I want one. one. I want one. How do we figure that out? Oh, shoot. I mean, there's like, you could go with like Noel, you know, yeah, <laughs> you, know, like you could go with like Mother Mary or something. I'm, yeah. I'm going to have to, I'm um, now I need one. Yeah. I don't have one. And I don't think there's any Jennifer. No. Well, the only one that I've ever heard, and I don't know if you have this in Canada, that starts with Jennifer is Jennifer Convertibles, which is like the these like, four yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It's like a funny, it's like a funny drag name, you know, like one of those like punny ones. So that's, that's the Jennifer one. I know. It's like Jennifer Convertibles. I mean, it's not Christmassy though, but well, no. I'll, I'll work on it. I'm going to circle back on the, on the holiday right. drag name. Okay. <laughs> well, thank you so much. I really appreciate all your time.